This story you are about to see is about one man's personal journey to find the truth that has been kept hidden from prying eyes. A secret of epic proportions that is tied to one of the most notorious cold murder cases ever told. Enter Legend of the Bucket. something to happen. That poor lady.
No, it couldn't have been you. Wow, right behind the, the bucket murders. No, this couldn't be. Shouldn't be. Wow. You are getting too fucking nosy for your own good. Well, who the hell are you then? There's no way in hell you're tops more. Ah, you figured it out. After all this time. Top it all off, we're not alone. You see, when I died back then, my body fell into a huge plastic vat filled full of hot plastic liquid. My body was never reported to the police. You wanna know why? Because whenever they went to find me. They used the hot plastic that they mold these toys with that had my body that had merged with the plastic. There's roughly 13 that I've been able to keep track of. Because you see, over all those 13 that there is, a little bit of my personality and my soul is inside each and every single one. But that hasn't stopped me. I see it as a perfect opportunity, though it was a little bit strange, to inhabit a little children's toy, but it was the perfect way to get away with murder. What did you do with my brother and all those people? You fuck. What did you do with him? Where? Where did they go? Why? Why are you doing this? Please explain. I need an ending. I simply killed them, of course. And the pleasure was... quite exquisite. And... also, your brother, I murdered him. And you see, his friend's body here I possessed it, since that is one of my abilities after all. And another thing, I felt that it was time that I get a flesh and blood body again. You see, being trapped inside of a little plastic toy has its advantages, but it was time to experience the pleasures of the flesh again. I felt that I needed to be able to murder with my own hands. I think I've said enough. My little bucket friend here will take care of you since you don't have much time left. <laughs> Wait, Dobson. It's the last thing I'll do. You will most certainly rot in hell. Ooh, I'm afraid that's not going to happen, and you're about to meet your maker anyway. Plus, I'm already dead. <laughs> hey, Mr. Bucket, cool bucket. Uh, 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 it's time uh, for you to die. You no. Bucket. Uh, no. Uh, Oh, no! Ah, uh, you will now! Ah, uh, 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 no! No!
Thompson. That's the last thing I do, like I said. But I've rid the world of anything you ever meant, everything you ever felt, anything you ever said.